how to make clips from your own podcast using AI. We're starting off with a simple edit before leveling it up to something much more eye-catching. Now, because I don't have my own podcast, I'm gonna use this Alex Ramosi podcast that I found right here. I'm gonna click on share, I'm gonna copy the link, and now we're gonna use it in wizard.ai. You can find the link for wizard.ai in the description down below, or you can go to their website directly. So this tool will save us a lot of time. And after logging in, this is what your project will look like. Now we can create a new project. We can click on upload from link here we drag in the youtube link that we have and now we can press continue and now it will do all the hard work for us so all we need to do is we need to adjust the preferred clip length i'm just gonna let the ai do this and now i'm gonna click next and now our upload is starting so because this usually takes some time to process i've already got one right here and this is the result so what wizard.ai just has done it has given us like over 20 clips, over 32 clips actually. And those are the clips that we can use from our podcast. So this like one hour long podcast has given us like 32 clips. And if you want to get your own podcast clips, then you can just simply run your podcast through this, or you can upload it from any other source like Google Drive, for example, and then it will do the same process. So now let's take a look at what our clips look like. Gordon, I think that more companies will have celebrity partners uh, in order to gain trust because cost to acquire customers on paid ads has gone up 100% in a very short period of time. So as you can see, it has taken one of the best parts from the podcast. This one is ranked one out of the 32 and it has given us a viral score of 9.8 out of 10, which is in their opinion, very good because it gives you an insightful perspective on the importance of a personal brand, trust and authority. So that's the reason for them ranking it number one. But you can also take a look at all of these other clips and you can find the ones you like the most. This will save you so much time by going through your own podcast or by going through someone else's podcast if you need to take clips from it. Let me show you some of the different styles that we have. So we can click on edit and now it will pop up a new window and here we can completely customize our entire clip. So as you can see, we have multiple speakers on this podcast. We have Alex Mosey on the left and we have the host, Lewis Hose on the other side. And Vizard actually takes like the person speaking on the screen and it will center it in the middle. And now it will give you the host, Alex Mosey, in the center. So you can adjust it also if we click on edit. Now we can see like the different styles that we got going on. So we can adjust this. We can also make it like larger and we can drag it over to the side. So for example, let's say on this side, Lewis Hose was talking, we can put him there. But for this segment, he isn't talking. So we are just gonna leave Alex Mosey in the center. And now what we can also do is we can adjust the subtitles. To adjust the subtitles, you can simply click on the subtitles itself or you can click on the subtitles right here. And now we have these different styles going on that we can choose from. I really like this one that we have right here. So I would actually prefer this one, but let me show you a few other ones that I really like. So we have this one. This is kind of like the standard Alex Omozi podcast style captions. Gordon, I think that more companies will have celebrity partners uh, in order to gain trust. Then we have this one. Trust because cost to acquire. And what's also cool is that you can completely customize these styles. So for example, it outlines it with purple and we can also change that from like red or anything that we like. So you can completely customize it to your own brand colors. Besides that, you can also change the fonts. You can change the letter type. You can also change the text color. You can do all of that within Wizard. Now this tool doesn't only just do shorts, it can also do like landscape, square, vertical, any type of video format you want. So this is perfect for like YouTube, uh, for LinkedIn, or also just for Instagram. If we head over to template, then we can see like all of these different templates that are available. And here we can see multiple different styles. So for example, if you have two speakers, then you can select this style and then it will put both speakers. If they are simultaneously on the screen, it will put them one above and one underneath that. And that's also pretty easy to edit. You can also add in a headline like you see right there, but you can also do it separately through the text button. And here you can click on headline and now you can give it your own custom headline. If you want to apply your branding to these videos or you want to add your logo, then go to brand and here you can upload your own logo and then it will be there in the bottom right corner or any corner that you want. And then your video will be branded. Now, if you have any specific part in your text that you want to highlight, then you can just click on the text and then you click on the right mouse button and 
and then you click highlight and this will change it to a different color if you want that now when you're happy with your click you can click on export and now your video will be ready to export and once it is done you can click on view and once this is ready you can pretty much download your video or you can share it directly through youtube tiktok instagram or facebook what's also cool is that wizard has a ai post generator so if you click on generate then your post will be generated to what it looks like on youtube and now it has like created a caption for tiktok it can do one for youtube it does the entire title description tags and for instagram it just does the description so that's basically how you can create clips with wizard.ai it is really fast and easy and it's also pretty affordable too just take a look at these prices with the price of just 16 dollars per month you can basically upload like 20 podcasts per month if your podcasts are taking an hour so if you want to try it wizard.ai for yourself then click the link in the description down below if you like this video then make sure to leave a like comment and subscribe and i will see you in the next one